Hi kids, um, you have just finished producing a number of different rotors and rotor stand and kind of looking at the rotors and seeing um, how they work in that rotor stand, okay? Now the whole idea behind this process is to help you understand how geometry and physics combine, okay? And the rotors that you built are basically if some of you may have already discovered it, basically what you have created are toy tops, okay? And what you did was you put them in the rotor stand and you got used to seeing how they work, adjusting them, tweaking them so that they wouldn't hit the rotor stand sides. But now what I'd like you to do is look at them as just a toy top, okay? Now, a rotor is found in a very important device called a gyroscope and gyroscopes do everything from help drones and helicopters stay in the air to actually helping your cell phone or your ipad know which way is up and down okay now anyways what i want you to do is to think about these as as they spin okay and what do you notice happening okay um do you notice how they create a geometric pattern as they are spinning okay notice that they are a geometrically when they're on the surface okay that they are at an angle that is at a right angle when they're spinning best you know they're pretty much straight up and down and you ha then you start to get this wobble and you see things start to go all haywire so um think about that you know the best way to hold it when you're starting it and what it does the other thing think about the symmetry okay in this thing all right and what i will probably have you doing is trying different things like putting on a different part and then trying to spin and see what happens okay and obviously whoa it goes all over the place okay so what i'm trying to do is to help you understand that even though this just looks like a very very simple design there's a whole lot of physics and geometry involved in it, okay? And so what I'd like you to do for this activity is to just kind of like build each one of these again and actually test them and see what happens, okay? And then at the end, I'll probably ask you to do some sort of challenge with the various rotors or tops that you've made, okay?